So if your super earth rotates fast enough, centrifugal acceleration could offset the gravitational pull. For example, uh, equat equatorial centrifugal acceleration is only 0.3% of gravity, but a planet rotating every six hours, so twice the speed, could make a two gram weight feel more like 1.2 grams at the equator. Literally double the spin, nearly half the weight. Isn't that crazy? Don't you think that's crazy though? I think that's crazy. I mean, do you want to find... Like, it's one of those facts that you learn and you go, yeah, but I really don't want to find out because what in, what's involved with finding this out? It's like long-term, high-volume bombard, planetary bombardment for science. It's so you can not weigh as much on the scale tonight. <sighs> one fat emperor away from it happening, right? So anyway, biological implementation. Giant humanoids might preferentially live at the equatorial regions where gra effective gravity is lowest. Ooh, we've got a... I can see a way in, guys. I can see a way into this working. Uh, but how much bigger are they? Well, okay. Imagine a 1 to 10 scale human. I think that's small enough. 10, 1 to 10 scale. All okay. right. I'm imagining that humans are 1 to 10 scale versions of whatever is living on this planet. 